just follow your trail And I'm losing your mind and I'm losing your head Let me escape from this some love cause I'm a prisoner Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel Today I will be showing you how I make my escovish fish and what I'm doing now is preparing the vegetables that will be used to make the sauce. So let's get right into the video. Okay, so because I'm one person, I'm only going to use a piece of each of these. And I'm using different colors because of course you want it to be very pretty. <laughs> so I have the green bell peppers, I have the orange and this is red so i'm just going to go ahead and slice these now this water to boil a little as you can see it's already hot and almost boiling and what I'm going to do now is to pour some white vinegar in the water I'm pouring like a cup or so Then I'm going to go in with some white sugar, also known as granulated sugar, and the salt, and a little salt. Now that I've added those, I'm going to go in with my vegetables. And of course, I'm going to add pimento seed. And I'm going to cover it and allow it to cook. I'm going to go ahead and prep or slice fishes and guys you can actually use any fish you want you can even use kingfish but I'm working with the sliced fish today um, and what what I'm doing is placing them on paper towel because you're going to fry it you want to get rid of the excess water so I'm really just um, going to do this to get rid of the excess water and then I will add my seasoning okay so I'm basically going in with a mixture of seasoning and I'm going to be basing each side of the fish inside out because you know you don't want to use a lot of seasoning but at the same time you want to ensure that your fish is seasoned properly so just just use your conscience like i said we want to get both sides and of course this is fish seasoning black pepper garlic powder all purpose um, salt so yeah well 
season. Uh -huh. No bland fish around here. going to go in with four pieces of garlic just to give it a nice flavor and I'm just going to add a piece of thyme as well And the fishes as you can see this is beautiful that is the color that you want your fishes to have Okay y'all, so as you can see, our fish is now complete. So what I'm going to do is to remove them from the oil, drain them, and then I'll share with you the results. So this is what our finished product is looking like. And of course you can eat this with anything you want, festival, bami, whatever. So until next time. Bye. I just want to lick my